What's up guys, my name is Johnny and today I'll be talking to you guys about five things you don't know that you're doing that's messing up your ear piercing, part one. If you guys already haven't done so, go ahead and subscribe, we're almost at the 500K, help us get there, like this video as well, and at the end of this video, go ahead and comment below your favorite fact from today. Let's get it. Thing number one, sleeping on your piercings. This is a huge, 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 huge thing people don't really realize. A lot of times you're coming home, like one in the morning, you're like really messed up, you had a great Saturday night, you just go straight to bed and you knock out right on your ear piercing and your ear gets very swollen in the morning and then you, re you wonder why your piercings are not always healing. Another thing could also happen is, in, while you're sleeping, you could be tossing and turning at night and you don't realize that you're laying on it, you're putting pressure on it. So sleeping on them is very, very huge. One big tip I have for you guys is picking up a neck pillow or a travel pillow and either putting it around your neck and sleeping on it, or you can actually sleep in the donut or in the whole part of the pillow. Kind of put your ear in there. That way, every time you turn or every time you want to like sleep on that side, you have that protection and a cushion from that pillow. So sleeping is a big no-no. Make sure you're not doing it, guys. Thing number two, you're always touching your damn piercing. I see this all the time. Client came in one time and she's like, my belly band's infected. And she's literally just like touching the pus and she's squeezing it out. I'm like, that's exactly why you're infected. That's exactly why you're having problems. So you could be like on the phone, talking to your friend and you could just be like messing with it and not really realizing it. Or you're in class and you're bored and you're just pushing the jewelry back and forth. So guys, keep your hands off your damn piercings, please. Thing number three, be very, very, very careful when you're putting on your sweater or taking off your sweater. Cause that's when jewelry always gets caught on something and it causes a major swelling and major pain for you. So please, 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 when you're taking off or putting on a sweater, a shirt, a bra, a jacket, whatever it is, any article of clothing, be very, very gentle because you do not want to mess your piercing up or hurt yourself doing that. Thing number four, switching your piercing out prematurely. This is so freaking huge. If you don't know when it's time for you to change your piercing, go visit your piercer, have them give you the correct day and time and place or whatever, just talk to a piercer, have them tell you when it's the time to change out. Don't assume that it's ready, or don't ask your friend and be like, yo, does it look ready? Or your friend's gonna be like, yeah, bro, it's ready, just change it, whatever. Don't be like that. You know, I've been thinking about changing this piece out. I'm getting tired of it. Bro, has it even been six to eight months yet? I don't care about what the piercer said, bro. It's, it looks ready, I'm just gonna do it. But are you sure, bro? I heard it's like gonna mess your ear up or something. Bro, I've seen all of Lou's body piercings videos. That guy Johnny doesn't know shit, man. He's not even a real piercer, just an ear stylist. No big deal. Bro, he knows his stuff, man. Like if you don't listen to him, your ear's gonna get like totally messed up, bro. Like you don't wanna do that. No, bro. Three days later. Thing number five, be very careful if you're wearing shades or prescription glasses because when you put on your glasses or take them off, it could be snagging on the jewelry, or whenever you're just resting your uh, glasses on your face, the back of it could be resting on the piercing. They got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on problems I solve them. I run through the money, the press will be calling. Left on my blessings, I feel like I'm falling. The birdie is back. Tell me I'm garbage, I'm going through something, that's why I ain't calling. Phone and progression, it's all that I wanted. The phone and affection, I summon and double it. Cause I got problems on problems on problems on problems on problems on. If you're gonna get a piercing, uh, my biggest recommendation to you is put your glasses on, have them mark it and make sure it's not gonna get in the way or bug whenever you're putting a glass on or taking them off. If you already have them, and they already marked them and it's gonna get in the way, either switch to, what is it called? Uh, contact lenses, that's a good option. If it's resting on it or simply take your piercing on and reposition it because when the glasses rest on your piercing, it's a big pain in the ass. And if it gets snagged on, it's another big pain in the ass. So be very, very careful if you're wearing glasses or shades because it can mess your piercing up. And here's a bonus one, number six, don't fight because fighting can really mess your piercing up. Be peaceful, don't fight, it's not the answer. There's always other ways to solve resolutions like talking. 
and putting your hand on someone's shoulder and telling them that it's gonna be okay and then there's no problems in the world and everything can be solved with love. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching today's video. If you haven't done so, comment below something you learned new in today's video. If you haven't done so, like this video, subscribe, because we're almost at 500K, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Peace.